Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm bringing to you payo and asmus uh, rice porridge, which we generally in the rest of India call it as kheer. So yes, uh, in Assam you won't find a single occasion or ceremony which is uh, which doesn't serve uh, payo. So let's get started. Uh, I am making this uh, recipe with Johar rice. Johar rice is an indigenous uh, grain grown here in northeast India, especially in Assam. It's an aromatic rice. So here I have taken 1.5 liters of milk and half a cup of Johar rice, which I have uh, soaked for half an hour and then washed it. I'll just add one teaspoon of ghee. If you add ghee here, you will get the a beautiful aroma and the taste will definitely enhance so don't skip this process and do uh, add one teaspoon of ghee what you need to do is you just uh, boil the milk in low flame till it thickens and keep stirring in between so that it doesn't stick to the bottom of your pan and always take a heavy bottom pan uh, so let the milk boil for about 10 to 15 minutes it's it's been boiling you can see it's thickening now and the boil has come so i'll be adding the rice here uh, when you add the rice just make sure to lower the flame and when you see the uh, after suppose 5 10 minutes add two tej patta that is bay leaves washed and uh, i have already washed this and I'll cook the rice with the milk in medium flame and stir occasionally. Remember to scrap out the uh, sides of your pan. When you notice that the rice is cooked half away, then you may add uh, two cardamoms. Split the two cardamoms and then add. I won't. Uh, I will request you not to add cardamoms in the beginning. Uh, the uh, this is because uh, the milk might split, so avoid adding cardamom in the beginning. So when the milk is reduced to almost two third, after that, just uh, add. Or when you see, you can check the whether the rice is cooked or not by using your fingers. Just uh, break the rice. If it break easily, that means it's good enough and now you may add dry fruits of your own choice i have added kaju and kishmish about uh, that is raisins about half a cup and i'll be adding one third cup of condensed milk now you may use sugar instead of condensed milk but yes condensed milk will give a richness to the payok and def that will be and you will get a creamy texture to the dish so i recommend using uh, condensed milk instead of sugar but if you want you may definitely use it so cook uh, this in, uh, after this after adding condensed milk and dry fruits cook it for around five to six minutes in high flame and then you are done because you will see that you will notice that it is uh, almost thicken so this is the and this is it try it out and I love uh, having this chilled so let me know how you prefer and please don't forget to give a thumbs up if you like my recipe and thank you for watching and do support your support means a lot thank you